Aloha, this is Evan on Live Yoga Channel working on Yoga for Beginners, our warm-up exercises today. These are great before your yoga class or even if you're going to do another workout, great opportunity to do some yoga warm-ups before you get yourself into your next workout. So let's go ahead and get started and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel at Live Yoga Channel just down below. Let's get started. So bring your right hand over onto your belly and we're gonna do a little bit of breathing to warm up. So I'm gonna warm up on the inhaling breath, push the belly out on an inhale, and then suck the belly back on an exhale. Let's do a few more like that. Inhale, just warming up the breath, push the belly out, and exhale, pull it back. So activating, let's do one more breath like that. Push, push, push the belly out. And then exhale, pull the belly back in, beautiful. Let's take both hands to the belly. Now we're gonna try a full yoga breath to warm up the lungs, get the breath going. So inhale, push the belly out. Suck the belly up and in, expand the ribs, trace the hands, lift the chest, keep breathing up. And then slowly trace the hands on the exhalation all across the front side of the belly, back down to the belly. Beautiful, two more like that. Inhale, push the belly out. Suck the belly up and in, expand the ribs, keep breathing all the way up into the chest, the clavicle region, and slowly take the hands along the front side of the body, all the way down on the exhalation. Last one, push the belly out. Suck the belly up and in, keep breathing into the middle chest, upper chest, clavicle, inhale, and slowly exhale, take it down. Beautiful. Let's release the hands to the sides. We're going to do some yoga for the eyes warm up. So many of us are spending so much time on our mobile screens and telephones these days. We want to do some yoga for the eyes. Keep the head centered. Don't move the head, only the eyes. Take a deep inhale. And on the exhale, we're going to look down, look up, look down, look up, look down, look up, center. Take another inhale. Exhaling breath, look far right, far left, far right, far left, far right, far left, center. Good job. Take an inhale. On the exhale, look down, far right, look up, far left, look down, center. Excellent. Inhale. Exhaling breath, look down, far left, look up, far right, Look down, center. Set up, stretching the eyes. Now we're gonna focus the eyes. Great job so far. Bring the hand up, not too high, not too low, just about eye level. Keep the arm in line with the shoulder. Focus on the fingertip with no blinking and slowly bend that elbow. Bring the fingertip in to the nose and slowly extend it out. Good job. And gaze all the way beyond, taking a moment to breathe. Inhale, exhaling breath. Do it once again. Bend the elbow, no blinking. Really good for the rods and the rone, the cones, the retina. Great job. Slowly bringing it in and slowly bringing it out. Extending the arm, gazing beyond. And we'll do one more like this. Inhale, exhale, bend the elbow, focusing the eyes. Great for the eyes. Fingertip coming in, no blinking towards the nose slowly extending all the way out. Great job. All the way extend, release the hand, bring some energy into the palms. This is part of the warming up. So bring some heat. In yoga we call it prana. Energy into the hands and then slowly right hand over the right eye, left hand over the left eye. No light coming in. Just let the eye sockets bathe. Give them a little breather and let some beautiful energy go into the eye sockets. Deep, slow inhalation and exhalation here. Great job. Let's release, take the hands and stretch the palms away, all the way overhead. And you can do a little side stretch if you want here. Just whatever is comfortable for you and slow down the breath. The air passing the epiglottis. Really slow breath at the back of the throat. Hmm. And then exhale, let's release the hands. We're gonna bring the right hand over the left hand, turn the backs of the palms to touch, turn the hands down, interlace the fingers and roll them in 
and over. This is yoga for the fingers, and wrists, and elbows to your degree. And then slowly take it out. We'll switch sides. So left comes over, right interlace those fingers. Roll them in, up, and over. Good job. Getting a nice stretch into the wrists and the elbows to your degree only here. Keep breathing slowly. Great job. Let's release. We're going to let the legs out in front. So no tension in those knees and get my toes. We do yoga for the toes here. So sit up tall. You can move the fleshy part away. Chest is lifted, chin's parallel. And we're going to squeeze the toes for one release, two release, three release, four release, five release, six. Hold and release. Great job. Here comes yoga for the toes. Right leg over the left. And just like we did with the hands and fingers, we're gonna get with the toes. See if you can get one toe, two toes, third toe, a fourth toe, no hands here. Try the big toe. If you get one toe, that's amazing. This is a great activator of the nerves and the toes all the way up into that sciatic nerve. So the biggest nerve in the body, sciatic nerve. Let's squeeze here. And then release. We'll try the same thing on the other side. Left's coming over the right. We're going to interlace the pinky, the second, the third, the fourth. So stay lighthearted here as you move into this. See if you can get even the big toe. Again, even one toe is amazing. When you get however many toes you have, give it a squeeze. Activate those nerves, the marma points between the toes. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And relax. Good job. So both calves on the floor, both heels on the floor. We're going to do yoga for the ankles. Extend for one release, two release, three release, four release, five release, six hold. And we'll go clockwise for one, two, three, four, five, and six. And we'll switch for one, two, three, four, five, and six. Great job. So coming up a little bit here, we're gonna move into the knees. So sit tall. Grab on opposite elbows underneath if you're able. Keep this right leg straight, left leg is lifted. We'll go for clockwise. One, two, three, four, five, six, and switch. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Beautiful, let's switch. Go to the opposite leg, grab opposite elbows, lift the chest, smile on the face. One, two, three, four, five, six and switch one two three four five six fantastic so come up a little bit and you're going to get the right heel in towards the perineum the left leg's going to come back we're moving all the way up the legs here into the quads see if you can sit the leg back take a little time here so big opening into the quads see if you can sit up tall you're going to start to feel that awakening into the thigh. For some of us, this is gonna be our stretch and we can stay here and just breathe slow. Others, maybe a little bit more open, a little bit more practice, slowly start to walk back. Maybe get to the elbows. Breathe there, take your time. If you're feeling open and you have the privilege, you can slowly start to walk back. Maybe take the top of the head onto the floor and resting the spine. If you wanna bring your arms overhead, you can do so as well. Take a moment and breathe slow wherever you're at. Press the elbows down on an inhaling breath. Come on up, take your time. Great job, and then we'll switch. So left leg comes in now, right leg goes back. And if you wanna move the fleshy part of the calf back, so no tension in the knee, this is yoga for the thighs right here, moving into the quads. Really nice stretch on the quads. Notice left and right may be different, so listen to your body, see where you're at, take your time. Great opening into the quad. Maybe to the elbows, maybe all the way to the top of the head. If you have the privilege, lay the spine flat, breathe deeply here. A couple slow breaths. And then place the elbows on an inhaling breath. Roll yourself back up. And from there, you're ready to go if you wanna go and have your sport. Great opportunity if you wanna jump into your sun salutations and move along with your yoga practice from there. It's a great warm up for everyone this morning. We're so grateful that you're joining us. 
on Live Yoga Channel, Mondays and Thursdays for Live Yoga at 7 a.m. We call it Aloha Time. That's here in beautiful Hawaii. So we look forward to joining you soon. Thanks for following our channel at Live Yoga Channel. Aloha.